Hey everyone, I've got a special guest on today's episode. I'm truly excited to bring Samantha McLean, the founder of Elite Agent Magazine. So mm -hmm. if you haven't got the copy, this is the latest copy. And we've got the winner here, Leanne from Mighty Mackay. Yeah, Leanne Drury, she's a bit of a she's a bit of a legend, did exceptionally well. Amazing. In Transform 2017. Yep. She did. So Sam, just for the viewers out there, I want to talk a little bit about how did the concept for you come around Transform? Because this is year two now that we've just done and dusted mm. for 2017, but how did the concept arrive? How did you think of it? I think yeah. it's a brilliant idea, by the way. Yeah, the um, the concept was originally well, it was originally called Accelerate, like the, that was the original name for the program. Because what we wondered is, after hearing from all the best coaches as we do in the magazine, could we just really compress that into yeah. twelve weeks and turn it into boot camp, and actually give some people the lessons and see if they worked across different markets and different geographies and things like that. So that was that was the basic idea behind Transform, and then it just kind of grew from there. It did, didn't it? Yeah. So the guys over twelve weeks have different lessons. Yes. They've got three head coaches this year. Last year did it all by myself. So thank you for I giving know, me I this know. year off, which was great. But I suppose they had Tom Panos, had Tanja, they yep. had myself. Um, but those key lessons over the, over those 12 weeks, can you maybe give us some, some idea of some of the lessons that these guys got to be exposed to? Yeah, so we started really by stripping them back, as, as you remember, like stripping them back to their why, like what are they doing here, what do they really want to achieve yeah. in the 12 weeks. So, so that was a real strip back and we know in real estate prospecting is king. Yes. So, you know, there was a lot of lessons around different types of prospecting as in calling, letterbox dropping, um, all of that sort of thing, how they're going to keep their database in check, like, you know, like collecting leads, social media, you name it. So all different sorts of bringing leads in through different channels. And then obviously we did some lifestyle things around it because, you know, like um, as Tom Panos said in the last one, you know, you want to have a beautiful life. If you're going to be a great agent, you've, you've, you've got to sort of sort your life out on the outside. Yeah. So, you know, we've done everything from health and fitness to um, you know, media networking and PR to, yep. um, you know, work-life balance to, you know, like all sorts of other different things. So we've really tried to run the gamut of, yes. of, of everything, yeah. including a bit of um, making over. Yeah, a bit of making <laughs> like, over. Like, you know, obviously Absolutely. a bit of making over in week 10, with photo, like a top model style photo yeah, shoot. So. Yeah, yeah. But Sam, let me ask you this, um, 12 weeks of transformation, if there was an agent out there today and thinking about transforming, mm. um, and we hear about the next 12 weeks, what would you, or what advice could you give or tips to these guys out there that are thinking, I want to transform, I want to make the decision to change and, and maybe get some momentum, get some traction in my marketplace. What would be some of the tips or advice that you've learned over the last 12 weeks working with the Super Six? Yeah, I think, um, well, Leanne was so successful because I think she took on board something that you said quite early, which was, you've made the decision to transform, that means everything must be a must. Must, correct. Like, you know, so yeah. that means like... Burn you know, the boats. <laughs> <laughs> burn the boats, as Robin says. Um, they, they put themselves in our hands and, and basically, you know, like we did give them you know, everything that we knew for 12 weeks. So there's no point in sort of saying, you know, like a personal trainer who says, give me 50 push-ups," and you go, hmm, yeah. like, I, can give, I can give you 10. Yeah, right, <laughs> like yeah, that, yeah, that, yeah. That's it. So, um, so, you know, it's important to take on all the lessons and be consistent about them. So, um, you know, and like what I've found in the magazine through all the agents that I've interviewed and all that sort of thing, it's, it's about consistency. It's yeah. about not doing something once and then finding it too hard and giving up. So you yes. know, you really, really got to be consistent with, with all of the things that, that you do. And I think thirdly, um, when you find someone's giving you all this training in 12 mm. weeks, um, and when you find you're doing all these different things that you're not used to doing, you need to really make sure that you have the time built in, yeah. the additional time, um, and that you aware you are aware that it's going to take you know a bit more time out of your life. It's not like you know like life goes on because Leanne found that yeah. you know like she was sort of um, I mean hers is, hers is a special story: single mother managing two teenagers yeah. and reinvigorating her so, career yes. and 12 weeks of transform so it's two hours of coaching a week plus implementation all the rest of it it does they do turn into long weeks yeah so what i'm hearing sam is if you're thinking about transforming three things you need to make a decision number yep. one yep number two invest the time yep and number three you've got to be consistent yep it's like i always say to people life is a process anything worthwhile is a process right so yep. if you want to transform it's not like you know it's going to happen Yep. overnight correct yeah like sometimes i want to put my 14 year old daughter in the microwave hit five minutes and she comes out like this 25 year old go, yeah, no, but it doesn't happen happened. right no, it's no. like parenting having children is a process you want to transform your business it's a process so yep. 
I think people need to understand that. Like as agents, we're always looking at that instant gratification. I want it done now and transform yeah. today. Yeah, yeah. But well, we did see transform in, in each and one of the Super Six, right? In different areas. So if you look at someone like Darren, social media. I mean, just the other day I saw him yeah. do a social media bit where he was talking about first home buyers and doing a, a video on that, which was cool, right? Well, Darren, Darren's, Darren's a legend now. Like I, I do remember, you know, like it was uh, Darren had had issues with putting his headphones in his phone, <laughs> like you know, yep. in the very beginning. And you know, like towards the end, we were seeing him doing live auctions. We were like, you know, so we really worked doing with him live, on yeah, Facebook getting live. confident in front of the camera. Yeah. Like, and and that sort of thing. So you know, he he did well. I mean, you know, they all had different things. You know, Nikki in WA, she was she was sort of carrying too many listings. She was carrying too much stock. And you know, like everyone thinks that you know, like more stock is always the problem, the, the solution to every problem. Yes. Um, but in some markets, no, it's not. So you know, like she actually started having to have the real conversations. Um, yeah. You know, gosh, you know, Ben, he made, you know, the, the, the decision to go pro. Yes, um, he did. You know, so he, he really took a step up in, in pretty much everything. Because yeah. he was good, he was yeah. good, solid, but just took that, you know, that additional step up. Um, and, and then just his mindset, just changing his mind, which is just amazing. I remember doing a bit of the mindset session and, you know, doing the three, seven second rule, just go bang. And he's actually applied that now to yeah. prospecting. And I remember not so long ago, you were up in visiting the office that he works in. Yeah. And he was locked himself in a room yeah, just doing the a, calls. Yeah, just doing the calls. Like, you know, like, and, and, but see, the thing is, is like, I think each of them were sort of, you know, week one, they were all sort of, oh my God, what have I gotten myself into? But, you know, all of them trusted the process, I yeah. think. And, you know, like, and they've all got amazing results out of it. And, you know, the end scores were very close. So, yes. you know, like it, it could have gone either way. They did, they all did such an amazing job. Fantastic. All right, look, I hope you've enjoyed this episode. We've got another episode with Samantha. We're gonna talk a little bit about leadership, which is in this current issue of Elite Agent Magazine. If you don't have a copy, make sure you grab a copy. And if you wanna see some of the coaching sessions that occurred during the Transform program, jump onto Elite Agent Magazine website.